and let's talk turkey. We're also going to do a turkey call craft with items you may have at home. So let's go. Turkeys are native to North America, but it's hard to get close to a turkey because they have excellent eyesight. It is said that they have three times better eyesight than our 2020 vision. And they also have peripheral vision, which is something like 270 degrees. Wild turkeys spend their days foraging for food, like wild berries, seeds, insects, and also acorns. At night, they roost in trees. Turkeys cannot see well in the dark. Sleeping in trees provides protection from predators that roam at night. And yes, turkeys, although big, can fly. They fly up to roost at dusk and fly down at dawn to begin their day. There are different ways you can tell a young turkey, which is called a jake, from an older turkey, which is tom, called a tom turkey or gobbler, just by looking at some unique features. A juvenile or jake turkey will have irregular contour tail feathers, but an adult male gobbler or tom turkey will have regular contour tail feathers. An adult gobbler or tom turkey will have a sharp and bony spur. But in a jake, they'll be short and rounded. Jakes have beards less than three inches long. A tom turkey will have a long beard. But don't be fooled, a hen, which is a female turkey, can have spurs or a small short beard. And also, did you know that a young female turkey, it's called a jenny. Let's make a turkey call. Wild turkeys communicate using body language and a variety of sounds. Turkey talk consists of approximately 28 sounds. Each communicate a different message in the turkey language. So let's make our turkey call. For this craft, you're gonna need one 48 ounce party cup, a string, which is about 12 inches in length, a toothpick, which I took off the sharp edges, and a small piece of sponge. So first you want to tie the string onto the toothpick. And I'll usually double knot it. Okay, then I'll take a nail and I'll poke a hole in my cup. Then I'll take the string and I'll put it through the hole. Helps using the nail. And I'll pull it from this end. in place, then simply tie your sponge to the string all right you might want to wet your sponge a little bit And then for the turkey call, take your sponge and grab part of the string. And with short strokes, you can make your turkey call.
it's pretty loud. <laughs> Thanks for joining us again for this edition of our five minute nature break. We hope you have a safe Thanksgiving and we'll see you next time. <laughs>